Yeah, it, it was a really good weekend for us. Uh, one and two or three. I thought the boys played really well. Offensively, we continue to show growth. I, I think probably Jordan Fusey being the guy that stands out the, the, the most in my mind, kind of his progression from the first couple of weeks to the third week. I mean, we were able to, to, to go back and, and, and watch video. We're really fortunate with, with the bat system. We travel with it. And so being able to have Jordan's video on file from all of his at-bats, I brought him in and, and, and we, we took a look and I asked him what he thought. And, you know, he, he was the one that kind of made the initial assessment of he thought he was a little bit over-rotated to start in the beginning of his stance. Uh, he wasn't seeing the ball as well. I thought his backside was a little bit internally rotated. And so we, we posted his backside better, did some, did some band work. We opened him up a little bit and, and changed his load sequence just a little bit so he could make decisions later um, and, and be a little bit more, the bear a little bit more open to the to the big part of the field, a little easier for him to turn late and keep the, the inside of the barrel exposed. And he made some really nice adjustments. Jordan's been a great player for a long time and has a great track record. But you know, every now and then it, it, you, we, we have to continue to make adjustments and, and, and the video really helps with those things. A lot of the data, the track main information allows us to go back through and to, to apply those in real time and, and not take weeks and weeks to make adjustments, but be able to do it day to day um, and really help the guys to, to, to be the players they're capable of being. And, and Jordan was a great example of that this weekend.